Hello YouTube. In my last video I stated about a new type of RF detector. I've never seen this type of configuration done before in any circuit, so I'll show it to you here. It's two tuned circuits. They're basically near the same frequency. And uh, there's nothing remarkable, remarkable about it because if you look at the waveform it puts out, it, you see the resonance of the one and the resonance of the other. Because they're both, uh, you know, the signal goes through both transformers and then comes out and they're rectified by their each, each, each of each different diode here. So I said that's the result. But what's interesting here is what happens when you f take one of these diodes and reverse the polarity. I'll show you that in a bit. Okay, so when I flip the polarity of these diodes, you see what kind of waveform I get now. One's going negative and one's going positive. Let me change the sweep with here, give you a better picture of that. So this right here is basically the makings of a perfect FM detector. I just have to tune the coils a little bit better to get them cl closer to each other as far as the resonance frequency goes. So let me tune the one here. And you see how it's getting closer. Now look at the waveform we got. some more so as you notice right here you get this nice linear curve that goes that crosses zero and goes either positive or negative so this this would be like a perfect FM detector or or, or con converting a certain range of frequencies to voltages so the lower frequencies will produce would produce a negative signal and the uh, higher frequencies would produce a positive signal uh, at its output. Now if I were to take both of these diodes and flip them around the opposite would be true where the positive peak would be here and the second peak would be down here in the negative. So you could, so depending on which way you have your diodes arranged you can change the way this uh, outputs the, this difference you know in voltages. Uh, give me one moment I'll show you the circuit. Okay so here's the circuit I'm using. I said, this is something I've never seen before done. I have an RF input, and then it splits and goes to each transformer. And then here, this, these, these capacitors on both ends control the resonance of this coil, which they're very similar, because of the way I wound them. I wound them both basically about the same. I mean, it's a sloppy job, but I could have done better. But for the, for the sake of this video, yeah, it, it works. So you'll see right down when I can get down to here from each output of the trend of the secondaries, one diode's face in one way, one diode's face in the other way. So if this one's resonance, if this one's at resonance, this one will be putting out let's see a negative. This one will be putting out a negative. If this one's at resonance, this will be putting out a positive. And when the frequency is bet exactly between both of the you know, both both the resonances, you get this goofy curve, or that uh, negative to positive swing curve, positive to negative swing. Yeah, but that's the uh, that's the detector. So I said this would make a perfect FM detector uh, by adjusting you know the adjusting the resonance of both these coils, make a great great detector. And as I've seen, I've never seen this done before, this type of a circuit. So. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for coming along. Please subscribe and we'll see you all again later. Bye-bye.